I heard your guys team up with someone it's kind of unlikely to uh, help out some of the local healthcare workers around Detroit. Do you care to explain? Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, opportunity came up and, uh, and we jumped on it, you know what I'm saying? We're, we, we're trying to uh, help out as much as we can in, the, in, in this time, you know, just like, you know, everybody else, I believe is trying to help out as much. We're trying to do our part too, you know? So um, we heard that they, they need masks locally, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, and uh, so we donated a bunch of, of shirts for the material to make the masks or whatnot, you know. Um, they were mostly they were mostly shaggy two dope shirts, so they don't really sell anyway. Yeah, the one the ones that didn't sell, you know, the shaggy two dope shirts. That's one of the ones we we sent them. You know, that we have a <laughs> like a whole stockpile in our warehouse of shaggy two dope swag. You know, what I'm <laughs> we make sure to send them all that first. I can't believe there's even a problem. With, with a shortage of masks. That's hard for me to understand. I mean, like, aren't they made of like a, most of them are made of like a thick paper or something, like a cardboard or some sort of uh, material. Yeah, I can't okay, believe yeah. that even though it's been, how long has it been now? It's it, that This has been happening like, a, you know, it's been several weeks and we still have a giant shortage of masks out here. It's hard to believe. 